Hey guys, this is Blue Tea Support, a knowledge base to help you have a better experience with Blue Tea. And today, we're checking out the Blue Tea AC200P. AC200P is a Blue Tea style design with signature blue and black, tons of outlets, and a sleek gray frame. As a high capacity power station, it's about 60.6 pounds, not so heavy to move. It has a capacity of 2000 watt hours for short time backup, while you can run 17 essentials simultaneously to keep your life going during a blackout. This pure sine wave inverter delivers a continuous output of 2000 watts, and it's able to withstand 4,800 watt surges to handle all your startup needs. No matter where you are, you can always count on Blue Eddy AC200P as your reliable off-grid power source. We've got the AC adapter, MC4 solar charging cable, car charging cable, XT90 to aviation cable, user manual, warranty card, and QC label. And there, the AC200P portable power station. We also provide some additional options like RV cables, lead acid battery charging cable, and XT90 to clamp cable for battery charging, DC7909 to XT90 cable for dual AC charging. All these are available on our site. Check it out here. First, take a look here. It's the power button and the LCD screen. Six 120 volt, 20 amp AC outlets, 2000 watts total. If you live in an area with high mains voltage, your AC200P may only have two dedicated AC outlets. Here's our DC output ports with four 5 volt USB-A, one 60 watt USB-C, one 12 volt 10 amp cigarette lighter port, two 12 volt 3 amp outputs, one 12 volt 25 amp output, and it includes two wireless charging pads on the top. Set down your wireless charging phone. Don't miss the exact center or you'll get a slow, less efficient charge or none at all. Moving to the recharging part, AC200P has a PV slash car input port and an AC adapter input port. Press the power button till the indicator light is on. Now AC200P is on standby to power your devices. If you want to power off, press and hold the power button till the light goes off. This touchscreen provides you with direct access to AC200P, so you'll know everything happening in it. Press this and select on. If you want to enable DC power, press this and select on. Here's the battery state of charge, input and output status. Press PV slash car and you'll see how much energy AC200P gets from the PV input port. Enter settings. You can customize your power consumption. Back to the home page. Enter the data page and you can check out the product info. Press an item and you'll see the specific information. If there is any error, please contact our customer service with the error. AC200P supports seven charging methods, namely AC, solar, car, generator, lead acid battery, dual AC, and AC plus solar. Connect AC200P to an AC source via the included adapter. For car charging, you need the car charging cable and the XT90 to aviation cable. Insert the aviation plug into PV input port. For other charging methods, you need extra accessories, which are also sold on our site. You can check out the details up here, or I'll link in the description below too. That's all for today. Please follow us for more videos, and let me know if you have any questions or ideas. Thanks for watching, and see you next time.